So I've heard this one recently that, hey, you know, I really, really thinking about buying a house and I want to use a family member or friend of the family because... Mac McCord, Red Light Real Estate. Today, we're talking about buyer agent compensation. So I've heard this one recently that, hey, you know, I really, really thinking about buying a house and I want to use a family member or friend of the family because I'm trying to save money and I don't want to pay my agent to buy a house. Well, here's the deal. Nine times out of 10, you're not paying your agent's compensation anyway. You're not paying a commission to your buyer's agent because typically that is taken care of by the listing agent. The sellers will pay to have somebody bring the buyer to buy their house. So in terms of paying your agent, you shouldn't have to pay your agent. A lot of brokerages and a lot of agents have different things, admin fees, uh, technology fees, all these added added up fees that they charge to their clients. I don't do that. I'm a pretty straight roller here, straight shooter. You don't have to pay your agent to buy a house. Lights turning green, gotta go.